Hello everyone, my name is Debbie Zalina. I want to share you about one of the interesting topics that I learned in educational research and methodology course. The topic is positionality. Have you ever heard about positionality? Positionality is an important component in qualitative research. Positionality reflects the position that the researcher has chosen to adopt within a given research study. It influences both how research is conducted, its outcomes, and results. So, how to find your positionality? First, you can locating yourself about the subject. Second, locating yourself about the participant. And the last, locating yourself about the research context and process. I have an example taken from the article entitled The Philosophical Underpinnings of Educational Research by Lindsay Mack. From her statement, we can see how Lindsay Mack locating herself to show her positionality. She located herself about the subject as a layperson and not an educational researcher. And she also located herself about the research process when she said that she began to analyze the different philosophical underpinnings of each paradigm and reading about the great thinkers' theories and the evolution of the social science research. Positionality is also closely related to reflexivity. Reflexivity is the concept that researchers should acknowledge and disclose their self in their research, seeking to understand their part in it or influence on it. Self-reflection and a reflective approach are both a necessary prerequisite and an ongoing process for the researchers to be able to identify, construct, critique, and articulate their positionality. Reflexivity informs positionality of the researcher. Through using a reflective approach, researchers should continually be aware that their positionality is never fixed and is always situation and context dependent. And reflexivity is an essential process for informing, developing, and shaping positionality, which may be clearly articulated. So, what is the influence of positionality on the research process? The positionality that researchers bring to their work and the personal experiences through which positionality is shaped may influence what researchers may bring to research encounters, their choice of processes, and their interpretation of outcomes. And the last important point is regardless of how they are positioned in terms of their epistemological assumption, it is crucial that researchers are clear in their minds as to the implication of their stance that they state their position explicitly. So, have you found your positionality? Now is the time for you to find your positionality and make sure your positionality can benefit society and the world. That's for me. Thank you for watching.